Hey, what's up? Jim with Lentini Cosplay. We're just giving a little other little update on our shop situation. Uh, it's going pretty good. It's getting a lot better. Uh, we've got two levels on it, which is pretty crazy. I've never done something like this, and uh, it was quite an undertaking, but it was actually pretty fun. Made, made you know, some mistakes, learned a lot, and uh, and I think that's the that's the biggest takeaway is. Uh, I know I'm notorious for overthinking everything and uh, procrastinating. So this one, we just decided to pull the trigger on it and see what happened. And and actually, I'm pretty I'm pretty okay with uh, you know the results. And uh, you know we've got we've got some temporary stuff you know right here uh, just until I get some sheeting. But that'll definitely keep weather out for the moment. But we got our siding up. I got to get some more. Uh, just go through and solidify a couple of couple of different things ran two by two by eights for my rafters um because they were they were it was like discounted lumber at home depot so it was like seven bucks a board so i really couldn't pass it up and uh for for future we're gonna i've got this as a removable wall in case i need to bring anything big in here otherwise this will which I've, I've got some ideas of what i might do over here i was thinking maybe uh I don't know, maybe like a fold down workbench or something like that. I want to keep the area modular so that that way we can be flexible with it and utilize the space without having to be like, you know, like nailed in or screwed into a wall for a workbench. Um, you know, I'd like to have a mobile, you know, work center that I can put into the center of the room and then move it around because, uh, you know, it's like once you go through and start utilizing it for a while, you find out that things don't work maybe quite as well, but then you're kind of committed to it and it's a whole chore and task to get things going again, right? So I, I'm trying to think of ways to keep it, uh, like I say, modular so we can kind of, you know, combine, pick in place or, you know, uh, you know, redecorate, if you will, you know, uh, as we see fit and as we grow with it. Um, and so go through and make a trip out here and we got our our second level up we were able to get our metal roof on which was pretty awesome um, we've got um, come with me if you will we're coming up here and we do have our loft area that's primarily going to be used for storage um, which is pretty great today today's task is to put a door on this uh, I've got a pretty good idea I saw a video if I can find it I'll go through and I could reference it down below um, but it was actually just a really simple you know barn door style um, you know, which is some angle iron and uh, some three inch pulleys. So I'm gonna be building that today. If, uh, you know, I might, I might do a quick video on that and just show how it works out. And uh, you know, if it, if it uh, works pretty well, I think it's gonna work great. Um, we'll just basically put it right on the outside. This wall is fairly temporary. Uh, the plan is, you know, if you can see right here is in the spring, We'll kind of kick out right there and I've got a wood pile over here for wood burning. Um, I'd like to be able to cover that up without having to do any extra concrete or an extra, you know, uh, pad. And, uh, you know, this will be just, you know, some extra storage area. Uh, we, we anticipated doing uh, a, a remodel on our home and, uh, you know, just, uh, life kind of got in the way and rates were going up and um and basically you know supply chain kind of sucked and so there was nothing uh you know there it was a real um gamble on whether or not we were going to be able to get it done it was supposed to basically we were going to start in uh february and we were still working on paperwork in june and then uh basically the loan that we were going to get was going to take uh you had to have it completed in six months and it was gonna be at least a month before we even put a shovel in the dirt to uh, to start, 
you know, the, the, uh, uh, renovation. So I got a little bit nervous on that. So we, we played it safer, um, you know, for better or for worse. And so this was kind of the, the, uh, the go-to and, uh, I think it'll work. I think it'll work out really nice. I'm really excited for it. Uh, like I said, it's, uh, definitely been a big undertaking, but I had a lot of really great help and, uh, we got, got a lot of things going. So I'll, uh, go through and I'll, uh, if, you know, if you guys want to see, uh, you know, the, the kind of inexpensive barn door, uh, you know, leave me a comment below, you know, hit the like button, subscribe. If you want to see more content, uh, we're going to get things going in the shop a little bit more. And hopefully in the new year, we'll be able to go through and start, uh, start back in on costumes and uh and doing some really cool projects and and this is going to be you know a little bit more you know with costumes and just general you know general stuff but we want to you know we got uh you know salt lake fan x coming up next year uh, in september and so we've got some big ideas that we want to try to implement and it'll be nice to have finally have a workspace uh to set up and dedicate and work on and not have to worry about uh weather and uh and just you know taking up real estate inside the house, you know, keeping the wife happy. So um, anyway, uh, hope you guys are all doing great. And, uh, you know, like I said, hit the like button, subscribe, leave me a comment down below, helps us out. And, uh, you know, let me know if there's things that you'd like to see. If you'd like to see a little bit more of what we did, then, you know, I'd be happy to show you guys. Um, but anyway, uh, yeah, things are going good. Keep at it. We'll talk to you later.